All right, people, welcome back. More Diondo commentary. So 902 here just went off. He went off and already took his first turn before he even started. So of course you can tell by the time we have Omega Chaos here. Hi, Omega Chaos here. And we got an interesting match here. We got 902 with 1531. And oh my God, look at that experience. <laughs> 843, 902 yeah, using Burning insane. Abyss versus Momochan. <laughs> 546 with 919 experience using Necros. And that beautiful Crush card. Ah, I just hit him. The power of Crush card. I think we saw this actually. Actually, we saw something similar in the league. On the first week, it was like Stu versus Pox, running a bit versus the Necros, and it was yep, out. Yeah, Crush card is so devastating against Necros. Yes, it is. For so. sure. He still has plays. He's not down and down. He has that cycle. But, oh, my God. <laughs> Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yep, yep, yep. Straight. So, we're still waiting on a major tournament. No major tournament has happened since the new list yet, like YCS or anything. Mm, no, I don't think so. So, it's hard. It's still kind of difficult to tell where uh, the various decks sit, you know? Yeah, there have been only ARG formats, but... Uh, they are on the different panelists, of course. Mm -hmm. With that Cosmo hype. So yeah. So stupid. And they are currently very hyped. They're like, oh my god, four four Cosmo decks topped, uh, top top eight. Like, you know, there are only ten participants in that, right? <laughs> <laughs> stupid. Like, just for a second, freaking uh, uh. Farm girl shot up to like eighty bucks. Like really? <laughs> yeah, I know. Like that's completely insane. <laughs> but I think I think what her price table to about what forty now. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> like you got that Bri, all right? Yeah, I got that Bri, all right. Yeah, just to make sure when I mind crush you, <laughs> I know what I'm gonna go ahead and call. <laughs> Minecraft still just a powerful car. We killed that Dante. He has that uh, a Valk. Some of that Valk. Valk is still expensive. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yep. Uh, it's interesting to see, still see that Burning Abyss or topping in ARG though. Yeah, definitely. I hope we've only one Seer. Yeah, one Seer and two Dante. You know. I guess maybe they can still do things. No. I think one of the things that makes Burning Abyss good is their floatiness. You start tearing apart their floatiness, then what are they doing? But eh, I'm not gonna tell you how to <laughs> play Yu-Gi-Oh. You can grab that Trish, that powerful Trish, and if that resolves, then the pain. <laughs> yeah, that broken Trish. Will have. Yep. Once that resolves, the game is pretty much over. There's the Trish. Please have something. Please have something. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that helps. That helps. I guess now Trishula can't. Yep, so Trishula can't use the effect because it's no. Yep. No result effect. Yep, that's good. That's good. <laughs> that, was, that was pretty cool. Now, too, I thought, I was like, wait, but even if you do that, well, now you don't. <laughs> you would, but now you don't because there's no hand target, so. Still, still has some pressure, though. Yeah. Yeah, the two would still on the defensive here. Uh, like I said, with Dante and the third touching each other, I mean, the floatiness can definitely be real, so. Yes, you know, Dante grab back that sir, sir, get that back that Dante. Oh, that preparation for. Yep, that preparation, though. Go ahead and grab back that cycle. Go ahead and search for, I believe it's a level 7 or lower. Yep. Okay, so I guess he's gonna go ahead and grab the unicorn and then use, use unicorn effect to go ahead and get a necros card from the graveyard. Oh, okay. That's Prince Princess probably to recycle that uh, street. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and activate cycle tribute. Dance princess, go ahead and summon the unicorn. And then Dan Princess will go ahead and get, get you get that back, straight back to your hand. Yeah. Not bad. Alright. Trish, go ahead and kill Dante. Dante the Fett, go ahead and grab back Sir. 
See? See? <laughs> yeah, like expected. <laughs> and kill Graf, and Graf will go ahead and summon, I don't know, Skarm? I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that works. Uh, you have to draw Burning Abyss to pull it off, though. So, hopefully, now that he draws the Burning Abyss, so he can actually pull off. Oh, well, mm. there's a problem with that. He, he has to keep... Well, has to run over uh, that. Yeah, when he comes first. Yeah, he when he comes first. first. Oh, nope. Another Dante. Ah, <sighs> Dante's expensive. <laughs> you guys know, so he did catch... So, you get Sir and Graf. So Graf go ahead and summon Skarm, and Sir go ahead and summon Graf. Another Dante? <laughs> yeah, probably yep. that's all they do pretty much. That's all you do. Detach Skarm, mill only one. There goes Karma Cut. Okay. And uh, set that powerful uh, Fire Lake. <laughs> Skarm, go ahead and grab Tour Guide. There it is. Ah. Uh, I checked the 902 book from the library because I read your plays. <laughs> it's oh, so obvious. Oh, I cannot type. So, does he have the powerful fire lake? I just want to know where Burning Abyss sit. Are they like what two, three, four? What 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 does this deck sit? I don't I don't know. Hmm. I'm just not. I'm not sure where this deck uh, sits right now. Where's you mean it? Burning Abyss? Yeah. Where does it sit? What deck? What, what number is it? Actually, I don't even really know where Necro sit either because there's just no tournament yet. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, people think. I think Necros might still be the best. I, I, I still think they are. I mean, I just think the current with one shred. I mean, their plays are hindered, but they still can do other plays, of course. So. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Exactly. You know, Ritual Beast, I mean, they're still a little bit inconsistent. Yeah, they are very inconsistent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, you know, that's why I can't really put them higher. Because I'm still getting comments to this day asking why heroes in the league, why heroes are tier 1 and Ritual Beast are tier 2. I, can, uh, I, I explain it. Heroes are more consistent. Yeah, I explain it and I explain it, I explain it, <laughs> and people just keep on asking. <laughs> and uh, heroes are pretty much the best deck in Dosh. Yeah, and like At I said, it's OCG heroes. Presented. It's just Slate chose not to use that version of it, but you know what I was giving him, he he definitely had the power, definitely worthy of tier one. Yeah. Like I said, if Ritual Beasts were just a little bit more consistent, I could give it to them, but you know, they're just, just really inconsistent sometimes. You can open up fantastically and go to town, and you can open up like crap and just do nothing. Cool. Because right, I want to add it to Locals. I dueled a Ritual Beast guy, and he, he wasn't the brightest. He wasn't the sharpest tool in the shed when it came to that duel. Oh, go ahead and throw the Maxi on there, that works. I tried against Ritual Beast uh, yesterday as well, in my in my locals, and I won against him with, with a Heraldic Beast Lord. Wow. But it was pretty hard to add, for sure. Mine was stupid easy. You just roll the die, who goes first? Me? Alright, drop tower on you. Game? Alright, all right, let's Hello. go to game two. Uh, I'm just like, who goes first? Me or you? He's like, you. I'm like, drop tower on you. He's like, oh, I quit. <laughs> I, think, I think the duel lasted like three minutes. <laughs> with, uh, uh, what? I don't understand the question, so, literally, the guy did not learn at all. Nope, oh, there's a comrade. I, mean, I don't think there's any burning abyss in my locals. No, I don't, there was, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Um, crap tat, crap tasia, crap tasia, that's what I record with. I hate Camtasia. <laughs> that was, why? Good. Crashes all the fucking time. <laughs> yeah, sometimes it crashes for me as well. It's like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, I would never pay three hundred dollars for this. <laughs> wow, burn this guy. He's getting. I mean, he's got. Oh, I'm for this, uh, future members. <laughs> yeah, <here>. future. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> like, never mind. The power. 
District of Carnival. Yet and get uh, that and into the end of the battle phase. Yeah, so you, you go ahead and take control of it. Is that game? Is that game, sir? Mm. <laughs> Hopefully you. I don't think so. I see you're 23. Because fusion number zero has only a, has zero attack, so. 23. And then is it how much you currently control? So 23. No, 21. My math is terrible. 21. No, that's not game. That's not game. Yep, I think 200 life points left. Something uh, I don't like feel that. like doing that kind of math right now. <laughs> so, yeah, take that. Take the 19. And take the 21. Yeah, that's not game. <laughs> that is a nice chunk, though. Your math is terrible. <laughs> you didn't even try. <laughs> 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 Alright, well... I hope that it's worth the push, because you, you gave him, like, a brand new hand. <laughs> it was max, you took that maxi challenge, so I hope it was worth it. Am I missing something? Mm. What do you mean? Why did he banish the unicorn? Mm, no idea. Yeah, I was about to say, like, you, you, you can't use mirror effect, right? Because he has a monster. <laughs> oh, Karma Cut. I forgot what Karma Cut's effect of... What's his additional effect? I forgot. That banished uh, all other monsters with the same name. That's the monster you banished with that card. Hello? <laughs> Look at this watcher's chat. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when you get just a little bit bigger. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's the end door commentary. <laughs> oh my god. I guess you are getting a lot of messages on the Yeah, end. they're asking, they're like, we're Stanzi and is this the turn? Is this the league? Like, no. <laughs> I, say, do you, I don't think you recognize any of these usernames on the league. They're probably not paying that much attention. He's just using, he's just using and abusing that, that shit. Hmm, that, oh my gonna, god, that bot's gonna yeah. put in so much work. <laughs> so, Brio, those two bye bye. Then that double Dante though. <laughs> Hmm. No skill drain. Okay. Well, those necros must can still beat you down. Even without mm -hmm. the effects. Yeah, they are going to punch you in the face, so. Go ahead and go into your ass and go on like, yes. <laughs> Interesting that burning the best place skill drain. Yeah, it was surprising for me as well. I mean, I sized the skill drain on Tower Carbo. <laughs> yeah, kill you. Both effects. <laughs> yeah. So now I'm trying to figure out what you're gonna do. God, look at these. Both these decks are just so good. Keeping up with resources. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Okay. <laughs> Looks like it's slowing down for the burning of fire. I said the skill drain, I mean, I guess, but I don't know. It just kind of feels like you're hindering yourself as well, you know? You really don't pull it off like Cleese do. Yeah, because burning abyss, uh, most most of mainly mostly have low mm -hmm. attack. That deck has a problem with authority figures. Yeah, I can't really get uh, over anything uh, 
2,500. Nope. It's, if it's stronger than 2,500, I guess you're not getting over it. Alright, kill you. And... Who is Trish gonna kill? <laughs> Still floating now. Oh. Oh. Oh, but that part of our phone. That might burn for a game at this point. Just activate it two times and yep. then that's so it. We can activate the barbar bar twice. If he runs two barbars, or if he can. Well, we can go ahead and get it back with Dante. So. I don't know, that might be a game. Yep, or why would it be Seer as well? Yeah, he can get it back with Seer as well. So. There is that acidic golem. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> okay. So, I guess detach. Yeah, that's game over. Pretty much. Uh, use power this turn, and then next turn can use it again because of. Uh, yep. Sir. It's interesting that he summoned it in attack mode. Yeah, there's really nothing the Necros Dualist yeah. can do at this point. Cool story, bro. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I said, am I missing something? Do you have some kind of idea, Momo-chan? <laughs> or is that it? You're just gonna go scoop it up go to game two? No, still trying to do something, I guess. So you get a Necro's discard to get a Necro's Beller Trap. And... Wait, Necro's have a trap? Do they? No, oh, they fuck, don't. This class is saying Necro's Beller Trap. <laughs> Let me back to your hand, it's weird. <laughs> I was like, wait, I don't remember them having a trap, or they just don't run it. <laughs> it's weird. <laughs> I guess Konami didn't want to spoil the fact that they wouldn't have any traps unless Necros aren't done. Please tell me they're done. <laughs> Do not fucking jump out the buses and bring <laughs> and do anything to Necros in the future. Yep. That's fine. All he has to do is just take that that bar, bar and crash it. Use the effect burn you for the rest, so this is it. Man. Yep. If that's a yeah, so many underestimated Barbar, but now it's one of the yeah, best cards in the I, deck. I definitely underestimated the card. A guy who, who he treats his Cowboy wins games and then Barbar, and they're like, no, 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 Barbar <laughs> sucks. Like, no, wait, I know, he's good. And what do you mean, um, yeah, scoop it up. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and uh, go on to game two after the deciding. So, we are back. Alright, people, we are back. Game two. And... I don't know, what's up with Necros allowing other people to go first? I don't know, it's just weird. <laughs> like, they, they want to have as many cards as possible. Yes. <laughs> and Necros are more of a reactive deck. They don't really want to go first. Ew. <laughs> I have not dueled against Necros with my Cleaves yet. I mean, of course they can get over uh, my towers with uh, with decisive armor. Yeah, decisive armor. Like one of. Or they should, just in case. Yeah, <laughs> case no. You don't want to just lose a game outright to towers like that. Alright, so how's this duel gonna go down? Go ahead and start searching up with the manju. wonder what that back row is. Yep. <laughs> oh my god. They're just talking about the cleave. I guess tries to go yeah. for that tissue love play. Yeah, can I try already. to push for it already? Yeah, he could pull it off. It's, it's not a bad play. So, I'm gonna go ahead and use that Brio. Probably grab shit. Yep. <laughs> yep. Mm hmm. Yep. 
Uh, of course. Core, of course. Yeah, that's all you do with Kaleido. <laughs> it's been a cool minute since I've seen anybody do anything with Kaleido besides that play. Remember when they were gonna? And it's the most common play of that. When they were gonna get cute and do the whole <laughs> seven double brio play. <laughs> but nope, not new. Yeah, that play was pretty bad. It's what it was not exactly that <laughs> play. Wasting brio like that. <laughs> They're like, oh wait, no, we want Bria to search. <laughs> so now what? Actually, those two and two? Castell? Oh, what time I thought of that? Maybe the bait dot of back row? Okay. Yeah, I'm guessing. Good to good. And to clear the field so you can. So they can search for the uh, with those mirrors. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I guess he's just gonna play Karma. Okay. Oh, Karma card. I mean, he just wanted to get rid of your backer. That's all he wanted. <laughs> Open up the floodgates for that uh, that powerful Trish. So you're gonna play some mirrors or something? Nope. Go ahead and play uh, cycle. Keep it shit. And summon and fish it off. Ah, sorry, man. Sorry, down and die. Well, if you pop the wrong card, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So close. He had a 50 50 chance. I hate when that happens. <laughs> oh my god, these guys are just chatting up a storm. Alright. Oh, damn, it just feels like you burn this guy burned through so much resources that he floats, so we should be okay. His turn. How are you gonna get over this uh Trish though? Probably it's in back row. Yeah, probably back row. Definitely mm -hmm. not with monsters. <laughs> Aside from maybe acid clan. Dante. Ooh. Starting to see some of that side. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. Move that card again. Take it and slap him for 27. Okay. Okay, you can have it back now. <laughs> Alright, so Mama Chan, what are you going to do? Oh, Rhoda. Search for, I guess, Clock Flips. Alright. Clock Flips gets, searches you a Necro Spell or Trap. This is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> it's a waste of text, waste of ink cut out. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Because there are no necro straps. And activate that kaleidoscope. Are we just gonna see another unicorn? Yep. Ooh. Ooh. And uh, future numbers effect is negated, so you yep. can just run it over. Wow. Hopefully Nano 2 has some back row to stop that, because, oh my god. <laughs> like, Momo Chan's like, hell no, we are taking this again, Tori. I'm using Necros. Yeah, the Necros toys might actually want to KA this yeah. turn. Wow. You know what? My brain's retarded. I'm not gonna, I'm no, not even gonna say what I was thinking for a second. <laughs> No, no, I'm gonna lose like all my subscribers. Everybody's gonna be like, damn, you're fucking retarded and unsubscribe. <laughs> you know what I was thinking? <laughs> I, was like, I was like, wait, he can't OTK. What? He has more than uh, eight on the field. I'm like, <laughs> like the wrong deck, stupid. <laughs> Why did that OTK yeah. happen? Like, Why am I thinking about him for place right now? <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, well, looks like we are definitely going into game three. That that OTK is too strong. He pushed with that decides to arm is. Mm, I wonder what that back row was. Probably nothing the same. Probably another skill train. <laughs> Alright, people. Oh, well, I was going to pause it and come back, but looks like they're already ready to go. So never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I, I just want to know where every deck sits. That's the problem. The regionals I'm going to is still is like the same weekend as like YCS, so I still don't know what's gonna be like the top deck. <laughs> Not that anybody cares about my regionals, cause <laughs> it's just a fucking regional in Utah. Like who cares? It's all about that YCS that weekend. <laughs> and we don't even know when we get nope. the next panelist. Nope. For all we know, we could be getting it freaking right after Worlds. Yeah, pretty much. That'd be surprising. Wow, that was a quick list. <laughs> like, oh, it's to make up for the freaking two weeks we took extra to do nothing. <laughs> Fuck you, get out of here. <laughs> yeah, indeed. You gonna go ahead and summon that money? And some say that uh, Konami didn't hit the top decks because they are pretty much the new standard. Well, I mean, I guess. Yeah. What do you think of Cosmos? Do you think they're going to be the tits like everybody expects them to be? Not yet. They are pretty good, but they still have some problems. Yeah, they don't have I'm enough monsters. That too. Uh -huh. I, my friend has them. And you have to get that battle damage in with a farm girl or you're not going to do Yeah, much. I was doing my friend and he had the deck. Every time I dropped towers, he'd always have the honest. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, alright. <laughs> but it was funny because I was playing chicken game and my life points would be lower and he would just be like, oh, farm girl attack. <laughs> you know, and he'd be like, effect, like, you didn't do any damage. He's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> it's so funny. But, you know, so far, I'm not too blown away. I mean, it's a fun deck. But I'm not like, oh my god, definitely, you know, top tier. Like, I, I just don't see how this deck can stack up to Necros right now. Yeah, definitely not. Yeah. Trishala just destroys it. <laughs> you know, like, one of the cards that you would love to side against Necros, of course, being Piran Wall, you, you can't do that. <laughs> like, I, I'm in yep. search, so, I don't know. What, what, could, what could Cosmos side against Necros? I don't know. I guess maybe you play uh, Mistaken Arrest and... Oh, I'm going to train. Wow. <laughs> no other burning events. Like, alright. <laughs> well, at least he has that 25 booty. I don't know. Mistaken Arrest and... I don't know. Maybe... What's that... What's that Ice Barrier card for Trish, I guess? I forgot what the name of that card was. Yeah. Mirror of the Ice Barrier. Wow. <laughs> the mills, though. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Alright, so. Yep. I'm going to go to the Maxi. And he's like, no, nah, forget it. I don't want to. So, uh. I nah. don't want to give Necros more cards. It's not worth it. He said no okay right now. So the special summoning of a burning wrist monster starts a chain, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes. And then some of that man wow, well, double search. Damn, he just like, you know what, scoop it up. Damn! I thought that was gonna go down no, much better. No. That rage quit that though. Rage like you could at least took it to the end. What was that? <laughs> what was that? Like really? He didn't even no more materials on his on I guess he was like, you know what, he's about to go for Trish and I I don't have anything to stop it, so might as well scoop it up. And still has yeah. six mm -hmm. cards. Scooped in it hand. up. <laughs> and just quit for okay, no reason. I'm assuming oh, Saw into the future, and he's like, I'm gonna get trished, and I have nothing for that. So, the last time he, last couple times he got in trish, he had he had an answer to it, but this time, unless he has a fact mailer, like, I don't know. So, well, I still would have had the resources to do something, I guess, even after it. that. I don't know. I don't know. 
That was, I ended really anticlimactically. So there you have it. Necro's beats Burning Abyss. <laughs> Which is interesting because in the league it was the other way around. But <laughs> freaking Stu just had the answers and kicked the crap out of Pops. <laughs> but hey, that's just yeah, how it goes, too much. you know. There's skill, but there's also luck. And, you know, he just kept on milling his, his side against uh, the Necros. And the Necro guy just got too far. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it. So uh, thank you, I mean, Chaos, for joining me. No problem. So, Glad to join you always. Head in Toronto Mega Chaos for the league. Uh, they are the captain of the Yusei Star Dragon, so be sure to support them. Yep. Uh, and also, their link is in the description, so go over to their channel and uh, check out their content. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And uh, see you guys next Tuesday with some more Dando commentary. All right, people. Thanks for watching. Yeah.